Every great change throughout history has come from the people. We do not have to wait. We can start the change right now. We, the people. Thank you. In the ancient time, individual human beings' life depend on family. The family, uh, their life depends on the community. Now, today's world, the entire 7 billion human beings are one human community. We have to think entire humanity. Most people I, I know, I encounter, haven't even heard of uh, feedback loops or tipping points, uh, chain reactions and so on. But they are so crucial to understanding how the world works. We have we have such a lack of respect for, for nature and for the environment that we just think that things will work out in the end. We cannot solve the climate emergency without, without taking these feedback loops into account and without really understanding them. So that is a crucial step. Where we are now is like uh, driving in a car in a dense fog and you know there's a cliff out there somewhere but you don't know where. Do you want to be going 60 miles an hour or should you be going about 10 miles an hour? The Earth will be just fine. We may take along with us, unfortunately, lots of different species. I'm not worried about the planet, I'm worried about us. If we take action now, we could slow, halt, or even reverse the climate crisis before it's too late. I'm optimistic by nature, and I become more optimistic when I see so many people that realize there's a problem. We can't allow it to be too late. It's time to act. If we don't, the planet will reach a tipping point where we will lose the world as we know it. <laughs>